Giovanni here came to see me back on October 26th. We've seen him five times. It's now November 2nd. So we've really only been seeing you about a week now, right? But we've seen him three times last week and then this week we're doing three times anyway. Hi everyone, Dr. David Cullor here with Synergy Wellness. So we have another case of a hiatal hernia. I want you guys to see how he's doing. If you're considering surgery, if you're considering PPI medication or you're taking PPI medication, it doesn't work, stop. You were taking PPI medication yeah. with a lot of acid reflux. Yeah, yeah. Now you're not taking PPI no. medication. No. You stopped taking it. Stopped Any acid reflux? Just a little bit, you know. Just yeah. a little bit. Yeah. So your acid reflux is better off the medication now than it was yeah. on? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The medication's not going to do diddly squat for you. That's a new word I made up. Don't Google it. Don't go on your dictionary and check for it. It's not in Webster's. It's not going to do anything for you. It's just going to help neutralize that acid. It's not going to fix the underlying problem which is the hiatal hernia. When the sphincter, the lower esophageal sphincter, gets caught up in that diaphragm, it can't close. Acid comes up. It's pretty common sense. It's very simple, this maneuver. It's risk-free, drug-free, and it will help you get off medication, fix the hiatal hernia, the source of your GERD, the source of your acid reflux. So we're going to go ahead and do a six treatment for him. Okay. Let's see. We might hear some gurgling. I'll put the microphone by his stomach. And there you heard it. You heard that was the stomach slipping down. This move, this maneuver is extremely effective. If you don't try it, you don't know what you're missing. Seriously, we have so many people that get help from this. Here's just one example. It's only been two weeks, 50% better. We're on the right track with him, okay? So go ahead, take another deep breath in. We might hear some more gurgling. That's okay. And there you heard it again. We're gonna do one last one here. And there it is again for a third time. Three for three. All right. Now I'm gonna tell you like I tell everyone, if you do have a hiatal hernia, don't sit up straight up in a sit-up position. Don't do that. You're gonna lower your diaphragm and possibly re-herniate, especially if you have a weak diaphragm. So I'm gonna have you turn over face me. This is the right way to get up, folks, and push off your elbow and hand, swing your legs over the edge, and sit yourself up at the same time. Okay? Thanks for tubing in. If you have any questions or comments, comment below. And thanks for letting us do this. Thank you guys so much. If you got anything from this video, or even if you just like this view of the Empire State Building and the Chrysler Building, give me a like, and don't forget to subscribe. Appreciate you guys.